And if you don't want the egg smell in your water, this is how you get rid of that. Take this screwdriver. Well, first you have to turn off the water. This is the water tank, and that's where the sulfur smell is at. And so what we do is we turn off the main water coming into the tank. You turn it forever. Yeah, it turns for a <laughs> while. And then we've got to take some of the water out to create a siphon, because we're going to siphon and put in hydrogen peroxide. And what do you use this, hun? Yeah, a cup. Use a cup of this. You put a cup of hydrogen peroxide. We'll just go ahead and do it. Okay, so I've got the water turned off. Down here is the water where I start letting the water out of the tank so I can create a siphon. And down here I can use the screwdriver and I just get it so I hear the water running. Turn it. I can hear the water running there so that should create a siphon here. I open this up. I didn't Oops. get enough water out. So I gotta turn it some more. I turned, I just turn it all the way. You turn it all the way? Yeah. I didn't know I didn't have to. Okay. So when you turn that knob. Then, then you turn this on, it create, creates create a suction. Pour your hydrogen peroxide in. Turn it off, turn it off down here. Did you turn off that knob? Yeah, I turned oh. off the right knob. Okay. It takes me forever. Alright, I turn this. So that's shut off, and then I can turn my main water back on. So it's just kind of reverse process. And then when you first turn the water on in the cottage, there'll be some air bubbles, so it's. But don't let it alarm you. And that's it. That should take care of the egg smell in your water.